Hey guys, how are you today? Today I'm going to be sharing with you a little bit of a hair tutorial. I'm going to share with you guys how I get this look. If you don't know, I do have naturally very, very curly hair. And I'm going to also share with you guys how I manage to use heat tools on my hair like a hair straightener every single day without damaging my hair or making it fried and frizzy. So if you guys want to see all of that, please go ahead and keep on watching and give this video a big fat thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more. Now, let's get to it two things number one i don't ever use a blow dryer number two i always like to use a styling cream heat protectant all of that but i hate putting a lot of products in my hair because i feel like it weighs it down and i do like it a little bit more like floofed up <laughs> so the products that i'm loving at the moment is this Kara therapy keratin fix 20 in 1 miracle leave-in cream the reason i like this cream is that you guys you are getting 20 benefits in one cream so it's gonna help to protect my hair repair my hair from any damage that maybe i've already caused to it um and it's definitely going to smooth out the hair as well so that my hair isn't frizzy what i like to do you guys is just apply this to my clean towel dried hair after i wash my hair when i come out of the shower and i'm going to show you guys that in just a second and what it does is after i apply it it just leaves my hair looking really smooth and silky and soft and luxurious and just beautiful <laughs> so this one here is also infused with some really great ingredients you've got caviar extract argan oil extract sunflower chamomile calendula oil all of that lots of oils lots of great extracts a lot of good ingredients to really make sure that my hair again is silky shiny beautiful and not frizzy or damaged. I definitely recommend you pick up something like that that's gonna give you all those benefits in one cream. This one is really great and actually I saw that they have a 20% off code right now. I'll go ahead and leave it here on the screen and in the description box. You can get 20% off which is a great deal but you guys this is a really good size product too. So I talked about I don't blow dry my hair but I still do use a lot of heat products like a hair straightener so what I like to do actually is wash my hair the night before once it's washed I'll put it up in a ponytail after I've applied my product and then when I go to bed I can sleep on it just slightly wet but when I wake up you'll see my hair isn't really super curly like it would be if I had let it dry naturally just air dried and it's not frizzy or anything like that and as always you guys any products mentioned in this video will be linked in the description box below if you want to try them out all right so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I get this sort of style Okay guys, so I just got out of the shower. I'm in my sleep shirt now. <laughs> and what I'll do is I'll just take my Miracle Leave-In Cream and I'll take a couple pumps of that. With my hair this short, I don't actually need a lot, so I'll just take about this much. And I'll just go ahead and start from the middle of my hair down to the tips of the hair, the ends. <laughs> and then I just take my wet hair and put it in a little bit of a low ponytail. I'll either clip it in or put it in a ponytail and I basically will just leave it up in a bun all day and then when I go to sleep I'll take it down and let it finish drying as I sleep but that's all I do as far as putting in the cream but I'm gonna finish my day out and then I'll go to sleep and tomorrow when I wake up I'll show you guys how I style it the next day okay guys so this is pretty much what it would look like once I wake up as you can see not a lot of frizz Normally, my hair, if I just let it sort of dry naturally, would be super, super curly. Probably really short because it would be like up to here. <laughs> so it would be really, really curly. It would be really frizzy and kind of hard to manage. But doing this method, using this product, just really helps to smooth it out, make it not so frizzy, and make it a lot less curly. Because I kind of had it up in a ponytail and a bun um, and kind of let it dry that way. So it made it a lot less curly, which makes it easier for me to go ahead and style it now the next day. I'm going to put up half of my hair. And what I'm going to do is straighten out these lower sections. And what I like to do is actually straighten these completely straight. Okay, once that lower section is straightened, I'm going to go ahead and take my hair down and take half of it again. What I like to do with this hair here is take it in small sections again. And I'll start by twisting the hair just slightly, just like that. And then we'll brush it out later on so it'll blend better with the bottom pieces. But for now, we'll just do this all the way across. Okay, 
Okay, now moving on to the top layer, I'm gonna do something different once again. And on this top layer, what I'll do is I'll take little pieces of hair and first straighten them straight like that. And then I'll go in and just add like a little bit of a twist there. And that's it. And it's just gonna add like a tiny little twist like that. Sorry, my camera did cut off, so I kind of missed part of what I was filming. But basically all I did was like brush out the curls, the really pieces that were like extra curly, um, and just kind of brush them out. And it just leaves my hair with like this sort of like messy look, not too done, but still done. <laughs> all right guys, there you have it. Let me know what you thought in the comments down below. And as always, you guys, all products mentioned will be linked down below. But don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!